Well, it was uh, in uh, the school year of 1954 and 1955 in my Texas history class. My teacher was uh, an avid outdoorsman and he introduced me to the Texas Game and Fish magazine, which was published by the Texas Game, Fish, and Oyster Commission, I believe it was. And back then the subscription price was a dollar or two dollars a year, something like that. But anyway, my first issue in my collection is uh, January of 1955, and I have every issue since up through the current issue. And I've read every magazine, I guess, from cover to cover, and and uh, reread them. I had a a uh, bookshelf for a headboard when I was at home and uh, I, my magazine collection laid at the head of my bed where my head was and I often uh, looked at them at night and uh, probably looked at uh, Texas Game and Fish and Texas Parks and Wildlife more than I did my school books but uh, uh, I'm proud of the collection and uh, uh, continue to uh, enjoy them. I have them all filed in the, the uh, cover that uh, I bought from you folks and uh, have a special bookcase to house them all and I have a few more covers I hope enough to last me for my lifetime and, and uh, continue to uh, collect the magazine and, and treasure it as one of my most prized possessions. I uh, enjoyed uh, Diane Cortez's short piece uh, on uh, Mother Neff State Park for this reason. I uh, have a heritage through my family of outdoorsmen, outdoors activities and hunting and fishing. And, and uh, my great, great grandfather built a quarter of a mile from Mother Neff State Park, an old rock house that came to be known as the Ball Mansion. And what struck my fancy about Ms. Cortez's piece was that I know that my grandfather trekked those hills and valleys. I know those big uh, pecan trees and oak trees that are still there, some of them were there 112 years ago. And uh, Grandpappy probably shot some squirrels out of them. And I think Carter Smith uh, got it right at the end of his piece in this issue when he said that uh, the, the wild things and wild places of Texas have never needed all of us more than they do now. And uh, So I'm thankful for my heritage as it relates to Mother Nell State Park. <laughs>